In modern warfare, intelligence can be more powerful than firepower. And sometimes, the most valuable weapon isn't built, it's captured. In this video, we take a deep dive into Iran's S-171 Black Hunter, also known as Cymorg, a mysterious stealth reconnaissance drone whose story begins with one of the most unusual intelligence incidents of the last decade. How did a captured American stealth drone inspire an entirely new Iranian UAV program, and what does the S-171 really represent today? The story starts in 2011, when Iran announced it had captured a USRQ-170 Sentinel, a highly classified stealth reconnaissance drone. While details remain disputed, the incident provided Iran with unprecedented access to a modern flying wing UAV design. Rather than treating the capture as a one-time intelligence win, Iran turned it into a long-term engineering project. Iranian aerospace teams began studying the airframe, materials, and systems laying the foundation for what would eventually become the S-171 Black Hunter, often referred to as Simorg. This moment marked a turning point in Iran's unmanned aviation ambitions. The S-171 is a flying wing stealth drone, clearly inspired by the RQ-170's design philosophy. Key features include a blended wing body airframe, smooth, angular surfaces to reduce radar reflections, extensive use of composite materials, and radar-absorbing coatings to lower radar cross-section. Its matte black finish is not cosmetic, it supports low observability and thermal management. While the S-171 may not match the original RQ-170 in stealth refinement, it reflects a serious effort to replicate fifth-generation UAV design principles. One of the most notable differences is propulsion. The S-171 reportedly uses a domestically produced Tolo 14 turbofan engine, adapted for long endurance flight. This engine allows the drone to operate at medium to high altitudes, maintain long loiter times, and conduct extended surveillance missions. Endurance is a defining feature of reconnaissance drones, and the S-171 is optimized not for speed, but for persistence staying airborne long enough to gather meaningful intelligence. The primary mission of the S-171 is ISR Intelligence, Surveillance, and Reconnaissance. While exact sensor details are classified, Analysts believe it carries electro-optical and infrared cameras, possibly synthetic aperture radar for all-weather imaging, and secure data links for real-time transmission. These capabilities allow the drone to monitor strategic areas, track movements, and support broader military planning. Compared to strike drones, the S-171's value lies in what it sees, not what it destroys. Some versions of the S-171 have been shown carrying small precision-guided munitions, suggesting a secondary strike role. However, this appears limited, small payload capacity, focus remains on reconnaissance, and strike capability likely experimental. This reinforces the idea that the S-171 is not designed as a frontline attack drone, but as a stealthy intelligence platform with optional offensive capability. Iranian sources have claimed the S-171 has been tested and possibly deployed in regional theaters. However, production is believed to be limited. Stealth drones are expensive and complex to manufacture, especially under sanctions. As a result, the S-171 likely operates in small numbers, reserved for high-value missions rather than routine patrols.
Its role is strategic, not mass deployment. The S-171 Black Hunter sends a clear message. Iran is capable of absorbing advanced technology, adapting it, and building indigenous alternatives. Beyond its military role, the drone represents progress in Iran's aerospace engineering, a focus on asymmetric intelligence capabilities and a symbolic response to technological isolation. In modern conflict, perception matters, and the S-171 demonstrates how a single captured asset can influence an entire generation of unmanned systems. The S-171 Black Hunter is not just a drone, it's a story of adaptation, reverse engineering and strategic messaging. In the quiet world of reconnaissance and stealth, its true impact may be felt long before it's ever seen.